So if you're a technical trainer starting out thinking, well, I'm going to really address these foundation skills, there's the first thing you need to do is actually have a look at the training you're delivering and what the units of competency are in the qualification and what the foundation skills are in those units of competency. So you need to identify those. Then you need to look at your learner cohort and have a look at where their skills and gaps are so that you can work out what it is that you need to do to approach the delivery of the training. So then the next step from that is planning your delivery, planning your assessment, looking at the kinds of training materials you use and the approaches you take and making sure that all of those things are going to support the development of foundation skills as part of technical competency. You might like to start working with a, a specialist in looking at planning your program. You might do some pre training assessment in collaboration where both of you work on some sort of tool or method to do some pre-training assessment. You might also work together on doing some planning of the delivery and the kinds of resources that you're going to use and also on the sorts of assessment tasks that you're going to use through the program. And that might be a good way to get started um, and then you could perhaps touch base with that specialist whenever you felt you needed to or you, you wanted to talk something over or look at, look at some material or look at some assessment. Um, so that might be a good way to get started and it could be a less funding intensive method of going about it as well. It's a true partnership and taking that to that level requires quite a lot of time and patience and working together beforehand so often there may be quite a lot of other ways you can collaborate before you actually get to that team teaching situation. In fact, you may never get to that team teaching situation because you may not need it.